So, a couple things I'm doing today. Um, there's the mailman's son has acquired a some kind of old riding lawnmower, and he wants to learn about mechanics. And when he got it, somebody told him it would run, but he hasn't been able to get it to run. So he asked me to help him. So I'm gonna go up to his house, and uh, we're gonna check the compression in the fire. Squirt some gas in it, and make sure the plug's firing, see if it'll crank, see if we need to rebuild the carburetor, which I suspect, or clean out the gas tank. That's gonna be the first thing. Then I'm going down to the gun range. I'm gonna qualify for center fire on the indoor range today. And then, uh, and then I'm gonna go after this bathroom, and I don't know how much of it, there's probably some real early videos. Before video was invented, believe it or not, I've been making been doing stuff like this before videos were invented but I created I took pictures of when I ripped up the old floor in this bathroom it was rotted out there in front of the tub and I replaced it out to probably about to the toilet or somewhere along in there I left the rest of it right in here. It's uh, kind of sunken in. And I'm thinking it's probably a little bit rotted right in here. But also we put this black tile down, the black and white tile in here, the rubberized flooring, which is awesome. But this is a room where Charlie kind of has an indoor bathroom because he's so little he can't go out in the snow to do his business. So we put these little potty, we call them potty pads on the floor. He comes in here and does his business for I think what happens is he misses the pad sometimes and it runs down between the cracks in this flooring and it gets underneath there and now it smells bad and uh, of course you can come in here I, I actually came in here and bleached the whole floor and everything the other day and didn't get rid of the smell so what's going to happen is all this needs to come up and since it's all coming up I'm going to move this out of here I'm going to actually repair the rest of the flooring and then we're going to get some of that click in place whatever they call that flooring nowadays that modern stuff so I think what I'm gonna do is just open this window and just pull all these up and start throwing them out the window I'll pick them up out there and save them they'll they'll go good somewhere out in the workshop or something like that but uh, and then I'm gonna add, figure out what I'm gonna need to repair the floor and then once I get it repaired I'm gonna do the new flooring we have this stand up washer and dryer here but what I'm hoping I can do is just slide it forward and then come in behind there and do the flooring and then get it up on top of the new flooring and slide it back in place and uh, that way we don't have to get somebody to come help me lift both these things up and break them down I'm, I'm thinking I can get the edge of the hand truck under there and lift one in and get that to slide this uh, rubberized flooring doesn't actually go underneath that it goes up to the edge of it so once I pull it up that'll be sitting on a flat floor I think I can slide it out that's gonna be the plan anyway so I'm gonna get me some gloves on stop start pulling up this old floor and tossing it out the window 